okay guys I'm back after restart let's uh, ag run again same software and let's see the next yes okay our installation is started Okay, we'll press next. I accept the uh, license agreement and next add VMware Workstation Console tools in the system path. Yes, check for update on the startup. Join the VMware programs if you want. You can join this or if you want to uh, automatically uh, update the <coughs> latest uh, for VMware software you can keep it check i'll go next uh, you can add the shortcuts on your desktop and your start menu next and install <coughs> so it will take uh, some time and then it will be installed and ready to use Okay, it's installed and we will go for finish after that you can have a icon like this on your PC <coughs> sorry we will double click <coughs> it's asking for license we are not using as a commercial use we were only using for a VMware workstation 17 for personal use and we'll go continue and then we'll do finish and here you go here is the main dashboard for VMware workstation here you can open your virtual machine if you have already have a one virtual machine before if you you have you want to connect to a remote server like um, VM <coughs> remote server you can connect here and then create a new virtual machine you can click here and you can create your new virtual machines here are some menus like file you can create new virtual machine here new windows open a existing virtual machine scanning configuration of auto start and connect to a servers <coughs> and then edit you most of the a lot of tweaks you have to do in your uh, virtual networks we'll go through again uh, via virtual network in the next video uh, full screen uh, auto sizing and uh, customize uh, library thumbnails and blah 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 and then we'll go VM you under power on power off stop manage install tools from here and this is your lab uh, home page and then you have a help here so this is the uh, VMware workstation installation video in the next video we will walk through the virtual network editor so we will walk through what is there and uh, how we can make some more tweaks in that and how we can use that one to uh, connect our virtual machines where that's a networking so hopefully you guys like my video and it's very very simple pretty uh, straightforward next 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 and then it's installed and uh, the main thing is this is workstation pro 17 is totally free for personal use so you can do your labs and your uh, make your different scenario for the servers and other stuff so if you like my video please do not forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for upcoming videos stay tuned take care bye bye